what is up guys it is germ donor back again with another video for you guys don't forget to hit that like button in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys the absolute best settings for PUBG mobile to get started go to your sensitivity settings change your overall default from low to medium this is going to give you a good starting point I'm going to explain what each one of these mean to the best of my ability the third person camera is basically just you looking around the camera is basically your free look camera, I, I think, I'm not positive. And the first person camera is the same as third person camera, but for first person. I'm going to list what I have for each one of these sensitivities so that I don't have to say it for you guys. So just pay attention to the words on the screen. But overall, these settings are just really important because it's your how you're looking around and spotting people in your environment. And you're gonna be able to do that much quicker with these settings. I do recommend getting used to these and increasing them as you get used to them. These are actually pretty high, but if you're going to get used to them, you're going to want to get used to them high at first because they're the most important ones. After that, we're going to go down to our camera settings and I'm going to list them on the screen again for you guys. To start off, the third person no scope is basically just you aiming without aiming down and same for the first person no scope, but in first person. Now the red dot, is, these are all just you aiming without you actually aiming down your sight. So if you have a red dot on your gun, I recommend increasing it high because your accuracy is going to be better if you have a red dot on your gun than if you have a four, four times on your gun when you're hip firing. So you're going to want your red dot a little bit higher and you're going to want all the rest a little bit lower or a little bit higher as well depending on how close or how far they are away. I actually move a lot of mine up uh, if you don't like them how high they are I recommend just moving them a tad bit lower but the red dot and the two times are pretty close scopes so I do actually increase the percentages on those ones Now getting to the three times, the four times, and the eight times, I put the three times at 25%, the four times at 20%, and the eight times at 15%. Just because you'll find that all of the scopes are actually by default a little bit too low in the medium sensitivity settings, but if you are just getting into PUBG Mobile, you do not want to start out high. Now getting to the aim down sensitivities. These are the actual sensitivities that you're going to be aiming with. So when you actually are scoped in, these are the sensitivities that you will be using. The third person no scope, since you're, you're going to be scoped in, I don't recommend changing this much. The same for the first person no scope. But the red dot, I recommend changing that to 55%, the two times to 35%, the three times to 30%, the four times to 25%, and the eight times to 20%. This way you are a lot faster when you are aiming at enemies and you are not so. Now guys, these are going to take some getting used to, so I do recommend going into training mode and aiming at a few of the targets and trying to hit them. The eight times, that is the only one that I would say might be too high for you guys. The four times, the three times, and the two times are definitely what I would recommend. Now guys, I didn't put the six times on there because I don't find myself using the six times as much. If you do use the six times, I would recommend 20% as well as the eight times. These are all the sensitivity settings I have for you get today, guys. I don't use gyroscope settings because I don't play with the gyroscope. If you want to check out some of my other videos on some control settings and some more tips and tricks, feel free to as well. 